Make a galaxy painting with me while I talk about my journey of experimentation with my artwork. So for me, experimentation is one of the most important parts of my art journey. I feel like all of the techniques I've acquired and gained over the past few years have been because I just thought of something and took the chance and risk of quote unquote ruining the piece or maybe discovering something awesome. So every time I try something new it leads to a new discovery and that's often something I can build off of and use in my future works and what I would refer to as a technique and something that you know I use as a skill to progress in my art. So with this painting it was experimental. I was not um, totally satisfied with the result at the end but I was trying a bunch of new things and I had a kind of vision in my mind of what I wanted it to be and it just didn't turn out exactly like what I imagined so I kind of was going for like with light around it like a kind of a ring of like light and, and brightness and then I wanted a like a matte black border around the circle and I wanted it to have a lot of stars and just kind of like a magical glowy feeling and then within the planet is uh, you'll see soon you know mountains and a, and a galaxy sky and a moon so for the the stars and the galaxy effect I was using mica powder as you can see here and that's uh, one of the biggest things that makes this piece experimental it's not a medium that I'm used to working with or have used a lot but recently I made another piece called come home to roses and I really enjoyed that piece I'll show you it here and that's that's the one where I first used mica powder in a significant way and it just created these beautiful starry effects so that's what I was going for here and the stars turned out cool it's just kind of the end result that I don't know just wasn't exactly what I was looking for but it reminded me of this really beautiful quote that I came across and it goes to get something you never had you have to do something you never did and that just rings so true and it's so profound to me because you know doing something you've never done is definitely asking yourself to step outside of your comfort zone and taking a step kind of into the unknown which can be a little bit scary and intimidating because you're putting yourself out there and there's a chance that it's not gonna work out and it'll be kind of a flop or you know just what you might perceive as a failure but I truly believe that no one ever became a master or really great at something by doing the same thing over and over we're really meant to push our limits and grow and play so I don't know I was just questioning you know why do we often why does play have to end when we're adolescents why don't we allow ourselves that creativity and that space to just flow without really focusing on the end result more a lot more about enjoying the process and knowing that it's an accomplishment to try something new in and of itself so i hope this was inspiring for you go out there try something new experiment get really creative with your art because that's you know the whole point one day you're gonna stumble across an amazing technique the path to success has many bumps along the way and ups and downs, so don't be discouraged and don't be hard on yourself. Enjoy the process and focus on learning and growing.